Hi, I'm Mark Littler. I'm an independent antiques consultant and whiskey broker. And in this video, I'm gonna to explain to you what a re-gauge is and why a re-gauge is important. Now, a re-gauge is the method in which the volume of a cask of whiskey is calculated. So a re-gauge will tell you exactly how much liquid is left inside of that cask of whiskey, because obviously it's been evaporating away to the angels. So when you're asking for a re-gauge, you're essentially asking the warehouse to test that cask of whiskey and see how much whiskey is left inside of it. Now, once you get the re-gauge, it will tell you two things. It will tell you the bulk liters, so how many liters of liquid are left in that cask as a whole. So for instance, 200 bulk liters. And then it will also tell you the ABV, or the alcohol by volume, so the strength of the alcohol. So it might be 50%. And then finally, from those two figures, you'll be able to calculate the RLA, or the re-gauge litres of alcohol. Now, this is essentially, if you've got 200 bulk litres, at 50%, you've got 100 litres of pure alcohol. Now, that is the factor that is important when you're calculating prices, and we cover this in another video. And likewise, it's the RLA figure that HMRC will use to calculate the duty owing on the cask of whiskey if it was to be removed from bond and bottles. Now a re-gauge is important because it tells you it's like the health check or an MOT of your cask. Now the most important factor to look at, other than how much whiskey is remaining, is the ABV. If the ABV drops below 40%, then that liquid is no longer able to be classed as whiskey. So even if you've had a cask for 20 years and you're planning to hold it for another 10 years, get that cask re-gauged immediately. It might be the fact that you're down to 42% ABV, so you really need to sell that cask quickly. Now likewise, a re-gauge will tell you how many litres of liquid are inside that cask. So if you started off with a hogshead, which contains 250 bulk litres of liquid, after 10 years, you might have 200 litres of whiskey. But at the same time, it's important to remember that casks can leak. And if you've hit a leak and you've not noticed or the warehouse operators haven't noticed, you could be down 50 or 100 litres. So it's important that you get that remedy, you know, to get that problem fixed immediately and raise it with the warehouse or insurance provider. So a re-gauge is a way of measuring what's, what liquid is left inside of a cask of whiskey after a number of years. And the two most important factors that it will tell you are the re-gauge litres of alcohol and the ABV. And they're important because that's what the value of a cask of whiskey is based upon. If you're looking to buy or sell a cask of whiskey, please visit marklittler.com. We've got dozens of videos and guides about buying and selling casks of whiskey, and we've also got hundreds of five-star reviews online. If you've got any questions, pop them in the comments, quest, uh, comments below, and we'll be happy to help.